people have quite strong um, preconceptions about what yeah. art might be yeah. or about what an artist is. Mm. And those preconceptions are very powerful in terms of, of already setting the audience up in a certain kind of way so that they only will see things in a certain kind of way. Yes. And I think part of my role as an artist is to try and question the audience's preconceptions, if I can, mm. to try and unsettle their preconceptions or to make people look at things in different ways to how they would regularly look at art. It's Belgium. Yeah. The show's called an earth, an earth. Yes. and which actually means in egg and in obviously egg. Yes. in English kind of means enough. Belgium for me smacks of surrealism in the case of Magritte, Magritte. or Marcel yes. Marianne yeah. and the sort of tradition I suppose uh, of surrealism in Belgium and the egg form as being this psychoanalytical shape that appears in dreams yes. Um, that maybe has uh, a Freudian values, has kind of interpretive associations. Originally this egg, this sort of two metre, like a, an egg big enough that you could almost like have yourself interned inside, almost oh, right, like a, yes, a yes. human adult size egg. Yes. Um, I have made a series of these in acrylic which were then painted so they look quite realistic, I mean if a, if a a giant egg could be realistic. Yes. Um, so they were then simulating a hen's egg or a, um, a turkey's egg. And obviously somehow something happens when you enlarge things. It has a, a sense of, of questioning just simply by the virtue of enlarging something. People ask me like, you know, what, what kind of work do you make? And mm. I'd really like to have a simple answer. I like, I'd like to be able to kind of say, I do this. Yes. My work really changes around from, and it does really move around, as you say. Yeah. Um, from, work, from piece to piece, from period to period. But at the same time, I think quite often, it does return to similar themes. So it's almost like there's a, there's a kind of a sense of questioning whether it's cultural identity, personal identity, um, whether it's how reality ca manifests itself yes. or how can we make an art which we might find useful or, or, or could be useful to help us to think about what our reality is. And these are very highfalutin uh, uh, subjects and very sort of, and they, they are kind of ultimates. Yes. Um, and it's, it's awkward to even mention it, but at the same time, it, it seems that for me, like reiterating it in different ways and trying to find different avenues and different approaches to try and pose the same questions almost, is, yeah. is, that just seems to be my way of working, my kind of mode of operation. Well, I am quite interested in the idea of trying to make the egg into a kind of signature. Yeah. And obviously there are lots of other artists that have done it as well. So yeah. I'm going to have to share that signature with other <laughs> artists. Um, but, but it is a universal symbol, that's, that's for sure. And it's a universal symbol. Yeah. I mean, although I'm not quite sure universe... I never really know about anything that's universal, but yes. yes. It, 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 as good as, it, I think it's as good as uh, uh, articulates and illustrates what the universe is. Yes, indeed.